Hello and welcome to another new video on Trick Tracker. I am Pratyat Tiwari bringing for you guys all the relevant details and the updates from the world of cricket. So what do we have in the news today? An update on Kane Williamson about his presence in the Indian T20 League. As far as the next edition is concerned, we'll take a look at what has Inzamam ul Haq got to say about Mohammad Amir's retirement before finally moving ahead towards Arjun Tendulkar's struggle with the bat and the ball. So stick around to the end of this video and find out the details yourself. Numerous speculations have been doing rounds on social media that the New Zealand batsman Kane Williamson is probably set to leave the Hyderabad franchise ahead of the next edition of the Indian T20 League. A lot of reports in the recent past have suggested that he will continue to play the Indian T20 League but probably not with the Hyderabad franchise. Now all of those rumours have been set aside by none other than the franchise's skipper David Warner himself. On 23rd of December, a fan on Twitter tagged David Warner and asked him whether the news that they are hearing about Kane Williamson's exit is true or not. Replying to him, David Warner stated that he himself is hearing such a thing for the first time and that Kane Williamson is not going to go anywhere and instead will stick with the Hyderabad franchise. So for all the Kane Williamson fans, for all the Hyderabad franchise fans, the update is that there is no ouster of Kane Williamson and he will be in the orange jersey again. Former Pakistan batsman and the chief selector of Pakistan cricket Inzumam ul Haq has got his say on Mohammad Amir's shocker retirement. It is worthy to note that the pacer aged just 28 years. He took retirement from international cricket stating that he has no desire to play for his country. Soon after the retirement, he even lashed out at the management stating that they have tarnished his reputation stating that he wants to play only cash-rich leagues and tournaments which will give him money and not for his country. All of that saga has escalated rather quickly and now Inzam Amul Haq is of the opinion that such instances only dent the image of Pakistan at the international level. While what he say is rather commonsensical and agreeable, he also stated as far as Mohammad Amir's decision is concerned that the pacer should have not probably taken such a drastic step and even if he had to, he should have at least consulted the head coach Mizbah Ul Haq or the team selectors before taking such a huge step that is as big as the retirement. Well, for all that we hope is that things cool down and that Pakistan cricket would be able to overcome this challenge. What are your views on this entire saga? Do let me know in the comments. Well, being a star kid doesn't come easy and definitely not if you're the son of the god of cricket himself. Arjun Tendulkar has found himself in a lean patch of form in the warm-up games before the Syed Mushtaq Ali Trophy, the tournament that is going to go underway from the 10th of January. After a lot of deliberation, it has finally been decided that this is how the face of the Indian domestic cricket is going to look as far as 2021 is concerned. But before that, before the tournament gets underway, there is some trouble and some worries for those who are looking to have Arjun Tendulkar on board because he has managed to just get seven runs with the bat, whereas he has struggled with the ball even more, getting only four wickets in the entire practice games. Notably, he was even thrashed by Surya Kumar Yadav in and over for quite a few runs. And it remains to be seen whether with this kind of form, he would manage to secure a spot in the Mumbai team. If he does, this would be the first time that he would be picked for the senior team of Mumbai. We hope that he would be overcoming this challenge and will be able to manage a spot in the team. Well, so that's all ladies and gentlemen from the world of cricket. I am Pratyat Tiwari and it's time for me to take a leave. If you like this video, do hit the like button, share the video as much as possible. In the comments, do let me know your opinions about today's news. And if you have yet not subscribed to the channel of Crick Tracker, do that as well so that you keep on getting all such updates from us in time. I'll see you guys in the next one.